Under his rule, Judah will enjoy safety and Israel will live in security. This is the name he will go by. The Lord has provided us with justice. The prophet Jeremiah chapter 23 verse 6. It will always give a Christian the greatest calm, quiet, ease and peace to think of the perfect righteousness of Christ. How often are the saints of God downcast and sad? I do not think they ought to be. I do not think they would if they could always see their perfection in Christ. There are some who are always talking about corruption and depravity of the heart and the innate evil of the soul. Whilst this is, of course, quite true, why not go a little further and remember that we are made perfect in Christ Jesus. It is no wonder that those who dwell upon their own corruption should wear such downcast looks. But surely if we remember that Christ is made unto us righteousness, then we shall be of good cheer. What though distresses afflict me, although Satan may assault me, though there may be many things to be experienced before I get to heaven. Those are done for me in the covenant of divine grace. There is nothing wanting in my Lord, for Christ has done all. On the cross did he not say, It is finished. And if it be finished, then I am complete in him, and can rejoice with joy unspeakable and full of glory. Not having my own righteousness which is of the law, but that which is through the faith of Christ, the righteousness which is of God by faith. You will not find on this side of heaven a holier people than those who receive into their hearts the doctrine of Christ's righteousness. When the believer says, I live in Christ alone, I rest on him solely for salvation, and I believe that however unworthy I am, I am still saved in him. Then there rises up as a motive of gratitude this thought. Shall I not live to Christ? Shall I not love him and serve him, seeing that I am saved by him? The love of Christ surely will constrain us, that they who live shall not henceforth live unto themselves, but to him who died for them. If saved by imputed righteousness, we shall greatly value imparted righteousness. Amen.